talk is pretty meaningless um, because I can say anything. I can say that I'm tomorrow I'm going to be a 400 pound giraffe. And it, that, that is feasible if I just talk about it, but it's not very realistic because I have no idea how that's going to happen. So for most people, the dream dreams do not come true. For most people, they, they say what they want to be and they don't do it. So what's the difference? Here's, here's the point. Here's what I'm going to get to. And this is something that I, that I hope to support you with uh, that, you know, again, God's telling me to share this message. So I'm going to share it. Um, so, so the question becomes, in my view, if you're talking about trying to be rich or whatever you want to be, what is it that is going to tether you from your existing reality to the reality that you're hoping to achieve? Like, what is it that's going to connect you, like almost like a rope? What's going to tether you to that reality and not cause you to fall into the other 10 million realities that could happen to you if you're, if you, if you're not focused or whatever? Well, part of it might start with things like accountability, uh, standards. A plan, a plan is a big start, you know, or you, you're, you're, you know, when you make a plan, you have accountability, you have standards. Um, and in fact, what I actually almost, the way I kind of view the future, and I still haven't mastered this, by the way, this is, a, some of this is theoretical. Now, I can't say that I've accomplished a lot of my dreams in my life. I, I, I can't lie. I, I, I'm very content with where my life is. Um, but some areas I'm like, damn, boys, you fell short. You didn't deliver. You didn't become the man that you said you were going to be. So, so a lot of it is almost like I, uh, when I visualize the man I want to be, say next year, you know. And we're really doing this together, by the way. I want y'all to know this. I, I'm, I'm, I'm a player coach in this game. I'm not that. I'm not just the teacher. I'm also the student, or I'm the teacher who's going to classes at night because we're all learning this together. I'm just sharing what I know, okay, uh, or what I see. So, so when I think about the man that I want to be, it's almost like he's a ghost. You know, the, the, the vision, and I want you to really one day sit down and visualize the person that you want to be a year from now and really maybe write that down, write down two or three characteristics of that person. Don't make it overly complicated because, that, and, and remember that that person is a ghost, they're a concept. And, and in order for me to, uh, to become that ghost of a man and to make him real, it is a very spiritual process in a way. It's very spiritual in the sense that in order for me to become him, I've literally got to leave my body. In order for me to become him, I have to kill the old me 